I think our first person here is somebody who doesn't need much of an introduction. Born in 1976. Is 75? 85. 85. He um, is not as old as I thought. You're aging poorly. Um, very poorly. Uh, no, I'm just joking. Miles is going to play... Um, just one song. Something. The guitar? The guitar. The guitar. <laughs> and uh, it should be good. He's going to play it now, and I think he's going to play a little bit later, too, just to break people up, because he's so lovely, and many of the other people are very bad. Um, <laughs> I speak solely of myself, of course. So, without further ado, Miles Pauly. Oh. Okay, Baba. Thanks for coming out, guys. This song is called The Christians and the Pagans. And it's by Dar Williams. Amber called her uncle, said we're up here for the holiday. Jane and I were having solstice. Now we need a place to stay And her Christ-loving uncle Watched his wife hang Mary on a tree He watched his son hang candy canes All made with red dye number three He told his niece it's Christmas Eve I know our life is not your style She said Christmas is like solstice And we miss you and it's been a while So the Christians and the pagans sat together at the table Finding faith and common ground The best that they were able Just before the meal was served Hands were held and prayers were said Sending hope for peace on earth To all their gods and goddesses The food was great The tree plugged in The meal went off without a hitch Till Timmy turned to Amber And said, is it true that you're a witch? Mom jumped up and said the pies are burning And she hit the kitchen And it was Jane who spoke up She said it's true your cousin's not a Christian But we love trees, we love the snow The friends we have, the world we share And you find magic in your God And we find magic everywhere So the Christians and the pagans sat together at the table Finding faith and common ground, the best that they were able. Where does magic, where does magic come from? I think magic's in the learning. Cause now when Christians sit with pagans, only pumpkin pies are burning. When Amber tried to do the dishes, her aunt said, really no, don't bother. Amber's uncle saw how Amber looked like Tim and like her father. He thought about his brother, how they hadn't spoken in a year. He thought he'd call him up and say, it's Christmas and your daughter's here. He thought of fathers, sons and brothers, felt his son tug on his sleeve, saying, can I be a pagan? Dad said, we'll discuss it when they leave. So the Christians and the pagans sat together at the table. Finding faith and common ground, the best that they were able. Lighting trees in darkness, drop learning new ways from the old. Making sense of history and drawing warmth out of the cold. 